Hello everyone, I'm Alvin Kailan and we're cooking in my home kitchen here in the beautiful San Gabriel Valley. And today we're making Tortan Kinilang, which is a beef omelet my dad used to make me every Saturday morning. It's delicious, let's get started. We have a cast iron pan here. We have some simple ingredients, ground beef, fish sauce, diced up onions, minced garlic, and 12 eggs. We're gonna get this pan nice and hot and we're gonna cook the ground beef. This is super important. You wanna make sure that the ground beef hits a nice hot pan. Wait for the sizzle, and if it doesn't sizzle, you messed up. All right, the pan is nice and hot. I got a little bit of canola oil right here. The oil is shimmering onto the cast iron, so you know what time it is. It's time to get this garlic, minced garlic, into the pan. You're looking for a golden brown look. Once you hit golden brown, which I'm achieving now, we're gonna add some onions. Hear that. The sizzle, super, super important. If you don't hear the sizzle, you messed up. You're gonna start all over again. We're gonna wanna season this. We're seasoning all the way through. You wanna make sure that everything tastes delicious. We're sauteing the onions for about, I'd say about a minute. My onions are just getting nice and soft. It's beef time. And right here I have 80-20 ground beef. And we're gonna cook this until it's brown. Not gray, brown. I hate when people make ground beef in a skillet and it's not caramelized. You wanna get a nice sear. You wanna get nice brown color. It brings out the, the flavor of beef. It's delicious and it looks great. While the meat starts to brown, let's get the eggs ready. In here I have a dozen eggs and I'm gonna pop the yolks. And I'm gonna give it a whisk. The key to this is to get the egg uniformly yellow. You really don't wanna get streaks of egg whites. You want it to be nice and uniform. You also wanna make sure that you're breaking up the ground beef. You don't want really large clumps of this stuff. You want the egg to coat all of the ground beef. And we're done. At this point, you wanna move the ground beef around so you kinda of cool it. Cause the next step is to mix the egg into the beef and you don't want the egg to cook right away. You want it to cook in the pan. While this cools, I'm gonna add my secret ingredient, which is something that my dad always put in our eggs for the torta, and that's fish sauce. Again, we're seasoning all the way through. So let's get that fish sauce incorporated into these eggs. All right, it looks like our beef is starting to get to a manageable temperature. Our pan is ready to go. So we'll drop the egg into the beef mixture. Give it a stir like so. And we're ready. We'll have some canola oil here and coat the bottom of the nonstick pan. This is to ensure uh, brown crispy edges. You got a little bit more. I know it's a nonstick pan and you're thinking, oh, it's not gonna stick. It might, but also I kinda wanna get that nice crispy edge on each omelet. So what I have here is a ladle and I'm gonna ladle this in. about two probably per, and we'll let that cook. And you see how that's bubbling up now? That's telling me that it wants to be flipped. So let's give it a flip. Perfect. And always fix that. There you go. Hit it with a little bit more salt. Just like that. 
You only want to cook the, the, the other side for about 30 seconds. There's your first one. And then we repeat. And we're stacking these like pancakes. Voila. Slice the scallions nice and thin. Voila. It's time to finish off our plate. I have a l That was empty. Never good. <laughs> We have a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. Just like that. My favorite crispy sea salt. And this was my favorite part. This was me when I was a kid and I always had to be cool and kind of like be disruptive. So I would always put ketchup on my tortanginiling. Just like this. It's weird, but it's a must. And to finish that off and make it look beautiful, we'll add some scallions. We're not yet done. This is not how we played it. Amboy style. You see how we, we plated it like omelet after omelet after omelet after omelet? And you might thinking, well, only the person on the top will get all the ketchup. No. I serve it a special way. We got all the beautiful layers. Egg, meat, egg, meat, egg, meat, onions, garlic, ketchup, scallions, fish sauce. Whew. Oh. That brings me back to my childhood. Nice beefiness, great umami. This is so comforting. Make sure you share this with someone you love. There you have it, Tortan Giniling from my new cookbook, and Boy, Recipes from the Filipino American Dream. Make sure you check it out at chefalvinkailan.com. Give me a follow at Alvin Kailan on Instagram. Enjoy the book, cook out of it, love it. Delicious.